Hey guys, we're back with another episode of Magic the Gathering, Duels of the Planeswalkers 2014. I, I wanted to hit like every possible range that I could on that one, since I didn't want to yell into the microphone as I often do. You almost got it. I didn't get to hear the Alpaca Patrol bass, though. Oh, uh, yeah, that's true. You gotta get that down low. 2014. Yeah, there it is. We did the that's Batman cool. showdown that other time. I mean, we get your bass range. It's pretty good. <laughs> Batman. Yeah. Oh, that's right. I remember that. Yeah, yeah. It's anyway, uh, that kid, man. That kid's real good. He lives in San Francisco. That kid's cool. I he heard he was crying. a midget. I don't know. What? I, I, yeah. He was a small child. Yeah, that's that going around. That it's just it's not a no. child. It's it's just a small person. Yeah, there's the the hashtag bat scam on Twitter, and right. then it's like it's that he was actually like a like if the do people analyzing the photos is like enhance, and there's like apparently some a little bit of stubble, and he's actually just a midget oh. and faked it or something. It's like 24 what, people just screaming enhance. From that? I don't know. What what, what would you gain? <laughs> Who wins? Who well, does win? Midget, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> how, how would he get away with it though? A very wealthy like midget Batman. posed as a Make a Wish Foundation child who wanted to be that kid. I saw uh, pictures that looked like a well, little kid. We're certainly starting the bar pretty low in terms of like political correctness here, so I guess it's only going to go downhill <laughs> from this. Already up, Austin. I didn't. Oh, oh, it's it's a, I didn't mention. I didn't do any introductions at all for people who are here. But I'm joined, of course, by my usual co-host Nick, Bear Taffy, and Austin. Hi. The last of the Great Wolves. Welcome. Mm. Let's start. Now. Oh, yeah, that's me. I forgot I'm the one in charge of starting. <laughs> Hello. Hi, we're I'm really Nick. How's it going? Playing magic in these magic we're episodes. not only are we good at playing it, we're good at the management that happens outside of the games as well. Right. And talking about poop and butts and oh. dicks. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> the past, literally, what, it's been like two or three months now. I, I had a hand with one mana, and then I was like, oh, no. I should have kept it, because that's what I've been doing the past couple of times. And then I redrew it, and now I have six lands. Five lands. I might have screwed myself on my redraw. It, whatever. Man, you guys got to play to win. <laughs> I wish I could play to win, but I just can't handle that kind of pressure, man. I want to so pay I think you guys all randomed, but I actually selected one of the new decks that oh, I just no. bought from the first oh, deck. That's the Austin way. Uh, that's that's the me way. I'd... Well, I haven't ever actually played it before. Like I literally just bought it right before we started. Don't this don't game. worry. You just bought a new deck that'll all target you now and kill you before you just a don't to see show everyone my hand and you're good. <laughs> okay. Well, I I mean I'm gonna. Then you're gonna have to go. <laughs> I don't have a choice, Nick. I should have read this before I played it. What does it do? Mm. As long as seven or more cards are in your graveyard, it gets plus one plus one and can't block. Okay. Interesting. That'll never happen. Yeah, Are we using the same deck now? Austin? Probably. Did you buy deck pack one? I did. Ooh, okay. Well, yeah. at least we'll finally get to see the cards in this deck, unless we both die very quickly. <laughs> well, All right, there you go. The new alliance, we have an alliance. Murder the same deck, people. So you guys are all playing black decks, huh? I randomed. I'm just well, sitting here. Ours masking. are black and blue. Yeah. Do you this have black blue. with your blue, Rob? No, I have blue with my blue. Uh, that's yeah. pretty racist. Yeah, I know. I'm a racist man. What can I say? Yeah. I don't like the blues. You love the blues. I like the blues brothers. Blues, blues is brothers. a good genre of music. It really is. Actually. I like the Beatus blues. The Beatus blues. Yeah, it's a Meat Boy song. Jerome Beatus. Mm. Who's Jerome Beatus? Jerome I don't know. Bettis a football player. No, Jerome Beatus. Yeah, a running yeah, back. Player, right? Number thirty-six for the Steelers. He's retired. Oh, man, you guys know sports stuff. Didn't they? Yeah. yeah, they did win today, yeah. Well, Let's we talk about football so we can alienate Nick completely from the conversation. <laughs> Go Let's talk Jets! About football in our Jets, Magic Jets, 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 Jets. Nick, no. No. Nick is a Jets fan, see? Yeah. I have to I have to persuade him otherwise for his own health, man. No. It's not okay. Jets lost today anyway. Yeah, yeah they, they got, got pretty cool. owned. Geno Smith was uh not yeah. <laughs> Real. This actually came up. I was in the car with my friend the other day. They took me to Connecticut to go get uh, my friends. Actually, uh, took me to Connecticut to get a hamburger from this famous burger joint. And in the process of going there, sports came up because I guess that just happens all the time. And uh, I was invited you made him to reveal his hand. Oh my I god! <laughs> I already hit you for two. You're doomed now. <laughs> um, but yeah, right. that that okay. came up. Doom and... blade zombie apocalypse. I was invited wow. over to, to watch some sports at one point, and I was like, so what are we going to watch, the Jets game? 
He's like, uh, I don't know, <laughs> like whatever's on. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, I you know I just I kind of pick whatever team the person who's with me doesn't like, so I can root for them to alienate them because they're already alienating me by liking sports. So that's, that's fair. Yeah. That's a bitch. That's nice. That's the end of my story. That just doesn't seem like the best way to maintain a friendship. It, it's a silly way to do it. I agree. Oh, bear! I learned this lesson the other day. You don't do that. I mean, I I had to for the sake of entertainment, and I'm willing to make the personal sacrifice as a result of it. Well, hopefully now you know that I have to shoot you uh, with lots of damage, otherwise I'm going to die very soon. Yeah, it does, it does seem like that, although yeah. I don't remember any of the cards you had. Ah, you excellent, had. I talked over it and you didn't pay attention. <laughs> yeah, I filibustered exactly. you again. I tried. Uh, I, I need to start taking screenshots mid-recording. That's a good idea. You shadow play. Yeah. Shadow shaman? Shadow burn. Something like that. Wow. Shadow this ramp. Shiny. I'll never play this card. It costs a lot of lands and I will die before then. All right. Shiny though. Uh, it's yeah, a really shiny card. All right, I'm gonna look at your lands and see which card is it, it is. Is it cursed? Oh. Should we give Dire Tide? Uh, yeah, oh. give Dire Tide. Guys, I know what card it is. We have to kill him now. Is it Dire Tide? Uh -oh. I saw the if lands. Dire Tide was a card. I think he should just win. You saw the lands? <laughs> oh no. I really land. want uh butts in my mouth. Oh, do you? Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> No, I can block just... that, Rob. Really? Yeah. It would be furry. I can make that happen. Be a lot of. Ooh, that's a, lot a cool of fur. card. Yeah. You guys are getting a little kinky here. Yeah. That's yeah. Stop. Bear, have you ever weighed in on the Charmin pooping bears? Since they're oh. part of your clan. <laughs> oh, well, let me do that in a second here. Um, uh, I'm gonna play this guy. Uh oh, yeah, that guy. Oh, you have to sacrifice the creature now. Because I'm gonna sacrifice. Oh, I know this guy. Another one. <laughs> Title Kraken. Well, that would be fun if I could do that, but no. Uh, oh, yeah, I did that the first time, too, actually. I think you're playing the same, like, deck that I played with all the same cards, too. Because I revealed Nick's hand, he got mad at me, murdered me, and then I sacrificed the Kraken with the, that card. But then they kept murdering me, so that's just the this next part. This deck is bonkers, man. It's pretty that, bonkers, yeah. That, uh, that Title Kraken card has some pretty cool art on it. It does, yeah, I like it. Looks kind of badass. Okay, but you want me to weigh in on the Charmin Pooping Bears. Are you aware of the Charmin Pooping Bears? Do you know what they are? You know what's interesting is I've more often seen them in ads that are in Spanish than I have in English <laughs> ads. That's which strange. Is really confusing. <laughs> I mean, I even speak a little bit of Spanish, so I understand a, a semblance of what they're saying, but it's still just kind of scary. Uh-huh. To see, well, like anything animated and anything besides your native language is just a little unsettling. I don't know, I like watching old, like, dirty French cartoons. They're really funny. <laughs> Are there a lot of those? Yeah, there's, like, there's, there's a bunch of, like, really hilarious ones. Because it, it's, like, in, like, the Popeye art-style cartoon stuff. And it's not, like, meant as pornography. They just made, like, I don't know, funny, dirty cartoons, and they're hilarious. That's pretty Wait, awesome. how are you to know what's meant as pornography? Uh... Are you saying that because I'm an alpaca, I can't tell the difference? Or... No, I'm just saying you can beat off to pretty much anything. Oh, uh, yeah, I guess that's <laughs> Well, then everything. <laughs> there was some real. jumping of ships. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I think, uh, well, then everything would be pornography. Technically, magic would be pornography. I could probably yep. beat off to that, uh, that putrid imp. Gross. And now people are going to flag this. <laughs> no. There, so the pooping bear thing is like they get all these little flakes of toilet paper on their butts, right? And oh, then the, like the mom comes like you're such a dirty bear, and then she cleans the butt off. Uh huh. But like, how's that a good advertisement for Charmin? I don't want to think about bear butts. I always <laughs> think about bear butts. I know you do, but that's <laughs> do why I was asking for you to weigh in. Like, how does this relate to normal humans? Right. I mean, I'm in a room right now with an alpaca, a bear, and a wolf. So I'm the only one that can really understand. Yeah. And I'm yeah, a rock, you? I guess. Yeah, you are a rock, I suppose. I we can poop on you. Oh, man. I have, oh. I have like, really good options, and I'm not used to this. Like, I want to weigh in the, <laughs> on the Charmin Bear thing, but I also, like, have the potential of doing really cool stuff, and I don't want to waste it. No, that's fine. Do, do your thing. We'll, uh, we'll okay. talk about Dire Tide or something. I have always... <laughs> no, actually, on the point of Charmin Bears, like, those commercials have always made me cringe. Since I was yeah. a small child, it's just... It's <laughs> weird, man. It's like, you just... It's on television. There's an animated bear wiping his ass, 
And it's like they try to make it cute because it's like a little kid bear. Like, ah, I wipe my butt, mom. And it's like, I don't. Why am I watching? Fair. Well, I mean, it's. I think butt. it's better than like kids that are advertising, like human children that are like, I just wipe my bum, mama, and then they come out and like, yeah. Charmin toilet paper. We can't children? really. Take yeah, but it's like show that or anything. I, I feel like I feel like if you're gonna make a commercial for toilet paper, I know what it's for. It's pretty self-explanatory. Sure. I don't think you have to make a situation. Like, they don't have tampon ads where it's like, like, hey, look at me put this mm. tampon up in my vagina. I think you know, they like, do, though. I think they, <laughs> they do. They kind of do. Yeah. Well, they're, they're, really, they're really classy about it for the most part is when they're yeah, doing like, I mean. ads for pads. and Ads for ads pads. Ads for pads. <laughs> Hashtag that shit, pads man. Ads in my yeah. fad. Oh, ads for pads. That's the video Let's make ads right for pads there. into a fad. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> I just don't tell that. your dad. But seriously, no. though, seriously though, like, like you could do something like that with a toilet. Ooh, you just be like, this toilet paper is really fucking soft. That's all you need. I don't need to see an animated version of a bear wiping his ass. Like I just don't. God, I want that ad to be a real oh. thing now. And the the marketing positioning <laughs> too. Toilet paper. Their slogan is "Enjoy the go." Do you well, ever, I when you think, think, the think toilet paper makes the go more? Right. Enjoyable. That's exactly what I was about to say. When you're sitting there shitting. Are you thinking about how much fun it's going to be to wipe your ass afterward? Because that's their platform. God damn it. Look, I never wanted to do this, guys. I never wanted to do this. Oh, no. What are you doing? Reset. Everyone has to discard a card. Oh. Oh. See, Bear used a card that made me put a card from my graveyard onto the battlefield. This is my only card in the graveyard. I did do that. Did do that. So this is Bear, everyone. Yeah, and I'm okay with it because I, uh, I liked the results. Yeah, I'm okay with it too because most of the things that I would discard, I'm gonna just get back anyway. Yeah, I'm okay with get it too because I just have fucking with. lands in my hand. <laughs> so whatever. Uh, don't do it. I'm Where gonna do it, Austin. Come on. Now. Do you want to go to it? Uh, I kind of. You know what movie I want to go back and rewatch that I haven't seen like Whoa. since? Yeah, it came Austin out. Powers. It's a classic. Uh, no, I've seen Austin Powers a bunch of times since it came out. I haven't seen Zoolander, though. Look at that demon of death game. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, wow, Six look at his face. He's not sure if he's some sort of an ant or a bee or a, an imp from Doom 3. He's awesome looking. He'll be something. Be in your He'll bee. Be aggressive. Be, be, be aggressive. I thought it was beat, beat aggressive, and they were just stuttering. <laughs> That'd be nice. Beat Aww. the aggressor. Beat the aggressor. Beat the aggressor! Quick, boys! Beat it now. <laughs> I don't understand how cheerleading uh, works. Like, how when you're a, a young girl in high school or, or you know, middle school or whatever, do you, how do you come to this conclusion? Like, I really have a lot of spirit, and I need to express it, and I need to come up with some sort of a vernacular to get this concept out of my body, and the only one that we've come up with as a society is cheering. You know, and it's actually a medical that problem that a lot of them have is they have an excess of cheer in their body Too and cheer spirit. leading is like it is it's a nice gradual outlet for that. Where they don't just have to right. like explode in this fusion of cheer in the middle of a classroom or something. Do they call the leader of the cheerleaders the cheerleader leader? Ha <laughs> I never thought of that in my life and I can't imagine how it's not come to this point. Well, I think maybe Maybe cheerleader is like a blanket term that we non-cheerleaders use, but in fact, the cheerleader is the leader of the cheerers. Well, they're collectively in leading a cheer toward the crowd. I believe that's the, the relationship. Don't they all hate each other, too? Yeah, they you have to hate each other. If I've seen like any cheerleader people. movies, and I have... They are uh, catty. They are very, very much angry at each other all the time. Mm -hmm. It's because of all the spirit. They're like, they're alpha males of, <laughs> of womenhood. <laughs> Be aggressive. <laughs> I mean, they take that to heart. They really do. It's true. What am I gonna do here? Do you and not that I was trying to like typecast gender roles. I mean, there's plenty of male cheerleaders. Should probably been a little bit more ambiguous with that. Are there male cheerleaders? Oh yeah. Well, the stereotype is that they're either gay or they're like in it for the chicks. But there's also probably the male cheerleaders that are just really full of cheer. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with that. Do what you gotta I don't do. Want you Rob, to have... the level of hate that I want to express right now is beyond I, comprehension. I just want that thing's. Health I don't care stuff. what you want. Wow. He doesn't care what you I, want. You don't care what I want. 
I don't care what you want. I care what you want, Rob. I want Let's you be to friends. Understand how angry I'm at you right Let's now. just make sure That's Bear cool dies because he showed my hand. What were you gonna do? <laughs> what were you gonna do? I was gonna protect myself, and now I will die. Protect you yourself. A nine, nine flying yourself. trample creature. Yeah, and Nick yeah, he's has gonna four die. Three death touch that he's just gonna mutilate me with. Wait, I am. Flying. Why am I gonna do that? Your thing because is, you don't like me, Nick, and you want to murder me. And How am I going to do that with my death touch? Because it kills my nine nine, and then I'm. So I'm flying. Well, You're if he attacks, I have to block. Rob you is have to block? building a phantasma army over here. Yeah, but yeah. it doesn't do anything. I don't like this. It one. doesn't well, do anything. I wasn't really planning on attacking <laughs> Austin, <laughs> but. <laughs> what the fuck is wrong? Why would you kill that thing? Because it's, it's blue, man. Hand. It's the I only thing that can be killed. Thing. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah. Well, I guess. Cool I your jets, yo. Get it? Cause your, <laughs> your team jets lost. Jets need to be cooled, son. Well, I mean, I lose now. <laughs> nah, you don't lose now. On the field. You don't lose yet. You don't lose until the last. That was pretty much the health. only good card in this deck. Rob, that is not. That was a pretty good Rob, card. Rob, 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 Rob. It did its job pretty well. Chill. It's gonna be yeah. fine. We got this under control. Are you, gonna... Are you guys still alliancing? Played? Yeah, we're alliancing the shit out of this. So much alliance. Is there is there much alliance? Wow. So so alliance. So alliance. Are you gonna Whoa. Oh first well I gotta take care of Bear because he showed my hand first, so that's the first priority. <laughs> you gotta stop, man. I'm not even a threat anymore. Yeah, you are. See Never yeah, see threat. this is exactly what I was fucking talking you about. You completely made yeah, the, the case for why I should fire. do this, Austin. I wasn't even <laughs> thinking about it until you explained it to me. <laughs> Makes oh, it wow. Well. I know what I'm doing next. What are you doing next turn? Gonna reveal your fucking hand. <laughs> oh, so you want to die next? I am gonna do things. We got a PJ Salt Factory developing in this Magic game. <laughs> this right happened now. last year. <laughs> why is this? Why is it PJ Salt? Does anyone know? It's uh, pajama oh, jam pajama salt. Jam. Yeah, that pretty J. What's the J stand for? No, maybe maybe he just Jemima. really likes Jemima. Wait, did you say Panama Jams? Yeah, he likes jam. Is that a is that Panama Jam? Panama Jam. Is that is that like a radio station? It's a killer in a man a canal Panama. Oh yes, beautiful. Reveal Rob. Rob, reveal Oh, you have no. Is he a cat? Are you distressing him? What'd you just do to me? Oh, I discarded a thing. hand. Why would you do that? Because I'm angry. You know how this goes every time. I know exactly how this goes. I've given up, Nick. I've given up. All right. Rob, you should make Nick reveal his hand. <laughs> I wish you wouldn't I could. do you know, that. You know what, Nick? I'm Nick, gonna make you reveal your hand again. <laughs> You're gonna reveal it twice. Oh, I didn't have a God. choice. Oh, it does a random one. That yeah. sucks. No, I pick. That's terrible. Oh, you pick. Okay, yeah. Yeah, because that that could have somehow turned into him getting demon at death skate or demon of well, death skate. Look at it this way, Rob. That's Every time he does that, it, that's it, one less card. That he didn't take from you. Oh no, I'm going all in. I know I'm dead. I'm going all in. All right, you guys are fucking. It's all you know you're dead. <laughs> all right, man. I'm, <laughs> I'm desperately hoping for a freaking draw card. I should have probably killed Why Austin's creature. Why is my title cracking in your graveyard? <laughs> That's my title cracking. You have a title. It's crack. my title cracking. Give it back. No, we both have title crackings. Oh, I see. Okay, well. Oh, you're gonna back out. Oh shit. You yeah, I'm gonna rise from the grave. Wait, yeah, I'm gonna take your title, Kraken. No, I'm no, gonna take, take my, my nine. Title. Take my nine. Oh, my nine is still on the field. Shit. Uh. <laughs> take his title, Kraken. <laughs> Even so, I don't think I could. I'm gonna take nine, my nine, 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 nine. Oh wait, no, I don't want that. I think I want this. I'm gonna take the the better one. Yeah, I gotta take the Scion of Darkness. Take the Bear Taffy, Scion of Darkness, confirmed. There we go. Yep, same. I started writing your name as B A R E Taffy, and now I can't see it any other way in my head. <laughs> That's understandable. <laughs> Why is it bear spelled like that? Oh, actually, I think you told me it's just because bear Taffy was already taken. Well, no, there's just a really uninteresting story behind it. Hmm. And I can hmm. tell it. Well? I'll tell it. Alright. <laughs> so I went to a Halo tournament a few years ago with a friend of mine. <laughs> Nerd! Sorry. A really nerd. <laughs> hey man, it was in Denver. <laughs> Denver that's that's cool. like my that's my defense. They have omelets. Um, 
They do. They have omelets, yeah. They have a big ass trampoline jump place. Like it's in a warehouse. Right There's trampolines everywhere. It was really cool. <laughs> mm. But uh, it's, it's, so you had a, a Halo tournament. Is that like part of the challenge of the Halo tournament? Is you have to be jumping on? <laughs> you have to play on the trampolines. It's wow. Really great. That's interesting. Um, <laughs> no, we, uh, well, my name used to just be my name. And then uh, people would call me Bear because it rhymed with the first part of my last name. And then. Oh, you pronounce it that way. Okay. Like, I get it. Yeah. And uh, then my drunk friend was like, hey, you should just be Bear. And I was like, that's a good idea. But he's like, but switch the vowels because it's badass. And the then that was like, was like, it's a really good idea, man. So oh. I did, and that's how I should you you know how they write like aether with the a e conjunction letter. You should use that. I would if it weren't so uncommon to see that anywhere. Right. Like available as a as a choice for a letter. But that would make you so badass just having your name with that special letter that no one else uses. I know. I know. <laughs> I wish I could. It makes the same sound too. It does. It's true. Uh, what am I gonna do here? I guess I could use the. Uh, well, I might as well use this. That's a Latin really letter. Call. You know what I never understood about Latin letters is why do why do the Latin letters have their own independent like words? It's never mm -hmm. made sense to me. Like Wrong. zeta and theta. It's like well, why does it need a why does it need a, a name? Like we have I guess we have a and b, but it's just that's what the sound is. Right. Mm. Yeah, it's uh well, it's pretty pretentious, honestly. Is the only is the only issue with it, except for W. Now that I think about it, because W is basically a word for a letter, and then it's not right. It's like a double V, right? Or a double V. Mm -hmm. Ha! This yeah, guy's a double V. All the way across the sky. You're not wrong. He's just giving me extra, more powerful creatures. That's all. I did take you down to one damage though, or one life rather. Nah. And uh, Rob, I get you, Rob, you back. Can, I want him. Why would he do that? So I'm gonna get this guy back. Also, I totally can't. Uh, no, but you could believe. <laughs> you can do a thing. Actually, I can. You can, but you can't. <laughs> oh, silly. Whoa. Staff of the Death Magoo. <laughs> <laughs> Juju Magoo. Wow. That's a Beatles <laughs> song. Yeah. Oh, title cracking can't be blocked. Right. Oh, damn right. All right, Rob. So get yourself up to seven health. You ready for this? Why are you saying all right, Rob? Because I'm, I'm doing life. this for you. Here we go. Oh, oh God. Right. Okay. All right. You got to count the damage. Um, two, four, like six, this. eight, ten, twelve, fourteen. You have to block one. You only have to block one. I will block two. You can block you two. I only have to block you one. Can block a two, two. I could block a two two. Block my two two. I'm gonna block a two two two. You could block whoa. <laughs> a two two two. Mm -hmm. A two 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 two. That just sounds like you're sneezing. A two 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 two. It does that. that I sneeze. choose yeah. second yeah. place. Oh, cool! Oh. I gain life because the third place of that creature. I didn't even think about that. AKA, it was completely within my plan and scheme the entire time. So if you could just kill a bear this turn, then I get to live another turn. That would be pretty cool. But you don't have to. It'd just be nice. Yeah. Or you could just let Bear do it and then not have to worry. <laughs> I'm just gonna be neutral. That's you should be neutral. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That wasn't probably the best move considering he only had well one creature he's gonna block with, I guess. Well, I'm going to attack with him because that way I get another creature card from your graveyard before you. Expired. When he dies, you lose those. I do? Yes. Balls, yeah, they go dude. out of play, man. I don't There's have them anymore. Balls. I think you lost. No, you didn't lose. Not yet, but that's you, a really you, you bad one thing. Remaining. Yeah. yeah, and that makes me sad. Mm, but he loses no. the free. Actually, yeah. you lose. Oh, you lose. No, uh, <laughs> no Rob. Yep. Rob, no. no. No one attacked Rob at all. This <laughs> you couldn't, you I couldn't have given me second instead of third. A commenter, um, a commenter mentioned this last time. They're like, Rob, you need to start fucking playing more strategic. You guys always fight amongst yourselves, and then you just let Nick <laughs> landslide. And I was like, you know what? This game, I think I'm just not gonna attack anybody. Doesn't matter if they attack me. I'm just not gonna attack. See if that works. And it worked. Oh, it worked. Totally worked. <laughs> I oh, didn't attack crazy. anyone this game, and then Nick was like, hey, fuck you. And you revealed I... my hand. You had to die. 
Well, it always no, said that I didn't every... reveal your hand until you fucked with you me. You did it twice. <laughs> It you also did. it also helps that you you have to play someone who's like re like a deck that's like really mousy and like not important because you know I didn't draw any attention or anything. Yep. It's like oh I got the and then I immediately destroyed the attention that you drew and then you were just on board quiet for the remainder, which ended up being the the deal sealer. Yep, yep, I sealed, right. you sealed. sealed that deal. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'd buy that for a dollar. Rob clubbed oh, a baby oh. seal. Thanks for watching Magic 2014. <laughs> well, in fairness, when you walk on something with a hoof, it's like clubbing it, and it didn't know it was there. That Do alpacas club? Alpaca oh, alpacas go clubbing all the time. Yeah. You'd be surprised. You, have you guys seen that video of the alpacas in a paddling pool? No, but I need to. Paddling pool. I have you not seen? It's like a Dr. Seuss book. Your video. Yeah, I'm gonna add that right at the end. Yeah. <laughs> I'm actually gonna do that. I'm gonna add the alpacas in a paddling pool at the end of this video. Yeah, I'll, I'll send it to you. You guys all have to add the alpacas in a paddling pool at the end of the video. Are they uh, <laughs> smoking cigars while they smoke? Will they swim? I mean, no, that'd be amazing though. I'm wearing police hats. <laughs> You're paddling. I think it'd be more impressive if they were smoking cigars while they smoked. <laughs> that would be very impressive. Yeah. Yeah. Sort I, of a tautology, ever... isn't it? <laughs> it's only the. The pool was filled with purple petunias. You know what I don't understand? <laughs> it be a lot He's trying to make it happen yeah. still. Purple petunias. <laughs> <laughs> you ever see that one picture of the guy, or like the world record of the guy who has a lot of cigarettes in his mouth and he lights them and smokes it and stuff? And it's like, you know. He probably died. <laughs> yeah, one, yeah. He's probably dead. And two, like. Did anyone previously hold that record? Like, is that really what's the point of world records if you're just gonna make some shit up? Like, you're just I, doing I it, just doing stuff. To have a world record, man. Like, literally, that's the the objective. Is there a is there a world record for like uh you know most ping pong balls in your beehole? Yes, you I could would start not it. be surprised actually. By the way, you guys should that say that back. sentence. Really, you own the most ping pong balls, one, balls yeah. in your beehole. You guys should say that sentence because it is really fun to say. World the record world record for, ping for the most ping pong balls in your b-hole? Yeah. It's a lot of plosives. Your b-hole or your p-hole? Oh, oh, if it's your p-hole, I don't own that. That's one. another that level. Well, you could add yeah. that to the end. Most most ping pong balls in your b-hole or p-hole. Now you've that, now you I add... don't think world records can have alternatives. <laughs> there's yeah, well, there's not... like an entire page in the Guinness Book for the p-hole ping pong people and the b-hole ping pong people. <laughs> okay, no, but there's one instance no, where that's there's... true. And that's the meta achievement for having the world record for having the most world records. <laughs> there is someone that who owns that. The there, there is a man who owns the world record for the most world records. Yeah. That's like the most ridiculous thing. Oddly yeah. enough, he holds no other world records. <laughs> <laughs> that kind of broke yeah, my brain a little bit. Getting dizzy. It's weird. You got to work on your blood pressure, man. My brood pleasure. Your brood Your pleasure. Brood pleasure. <laughs> you pleasure the brood. I must pleasure my brood. Man, I can't not think of StarCraft when you say that. Yeah, I know. I was just thinking about that. God, I want the new... I want Legacy of the Void really bad. I don't. I don't want that to come out. You don't. Did you guys ever play StarCraft, uh, Heart of the Swarm, and uh, Wings of Liberty and stuff? Hots? No. Yeah. Never played. It's good. It's I only so played the original too. StarCraft. Never even bought the second one. You should. Yeah, it's, it's, like, it's always too expensive, really and it's like a Blizzard game, and it's got like DRM and shit, right? Like, I just don't bother. Uh, it doesn't really. Like, it, it has like DRM in that you have to. Well, no, you can fall play under it. the requirements of DRM. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know. It's 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 fun. It, like the campaigns are really fun, and if you like the story in StarCraft One, uh, you you could um. You, you'd like StarCraft 2. By the way, this Magic episode is sponsored by Blizzard. Uh, actually, <laughs> uh, I'd like to say... Shit. That's, that's, I wish I knew that before. Before Rob makes too much money. <laughs> <laughs> abort, abort. Oh, God. There's that's the abort. worst problem, making too much money. Yeah, Bort. <laughs> Bort Simpson. Bort. Well, I was, I was watching, there was like a 60 Minutes thing today about... Warren Buffett and Bill Gates giving away their fortune. Right. And the Koch brothers. Did they? Did they give away their fortune? No, no, they just make too much money. That's oh, all. Okay. Yeah, and that's they fair enough. Make... They make a lot of money. They make a They're, lot of money. They were tied for fifth and fifth most money in the U.S. What's really funny is they were tied for fifth and fifth? Yeah. 
I, don't th I think that might be redundant. <laughs> it very well may be, and also might be. <laughs> oh, I see. <laughs> clever. <laughs> very clever. Um, well, uh, unless anybody else wants to talk about butts or something, I think that's the end of magic. Oh, we gotta save that for another episode. Just yeah, make sure when you next magic. time you poop, make sure you enjoy the go, and think about Charmin <laughs> products. Yeah. And don't also, tell me this Charmin is, is sponsoring this. That episode. was what I was about Charmin to say. Charmin and Blizzard kind of go together really well, actually. Oh. When I think about it, I applaud your fortuitousness. They clean Wait. up the mistakes that were the Diablo 3 launch. <laughs> Boom. Got him. Shots Got him. I wanted to go back Ace. to Diablo 3 really bad, actually, and well. see if it's better. Because I heard that they changed items so that they weren't just like, oh, this is two damage points better right. than this one. Rob, and I have a proposition for you. All when right. they remove the auction house from Diablo 3, which is coming up, I think, in the next few months, why don't we yep. both play a bunch of Diablo 3 together and make videos about it? You want to do I'm that? I'm fucking with it, yeah, for All sure. Right. So we'll talk yeah, about you, that then. You You're fucking with it? Uh, aren't invited, by the way. So. Yeah. Oh. Well, God damn. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Bear's already left the room. He thought. Yeah, he's gone. gone. <laughs> God damn it. He's going to go enjoy the go, and so should you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you to our sponsors again, Blizzard and Charmin. <laughs> and thank you for uh, all the people viewing, and I hope you enjoy the episode. As always, remember to check out everyone's perspective. I think everyone except for Austin recorded, right? Is that correct? Yes. It's true. Yeah. yes. So we'll have links for everybody's Wait. channels. And uh, we'll be back again. Mondays and Fridays are new episodes, unless anything tragic happens, which it shouldn't. But Monday's going to be a, The day that this goes up is going to be a, an interesting day for YouTube stuff. Not to get off in a new tangent, but I'm just saying, it'll be interesting. So said we'll goodbye, see. Nick, and you kept going. Now I know. <laughs> now I'm going to say for reals. Bye, everyone. Bye. Enjoy your poops. Enjoy, Sherman. Maybe I'll keep <laughs> it like, in. I wonder if people think that we, we talk about butts specifically for, like, the episodes. It's no, not we just talk episode. about butts a lot. It's just all the time. Yeah. It just comes up in conversation. Yeah. Oh, it comes yeah. up. Things comes up, you know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Penises come up.